Hello and welcome to Honeybee Snorkets. First things first before we dive into the video, uh, please give a thumbs up and subscribe, subscribe to the channel. It's absolutely free, but I would really appreciate it if you just subscribed. It means a lot to me. Thanks already and now let's get to the video. Today I'm going to show how to use a refractometer to uh, to check the sugar level in, uh, in honey. What is a refractometer? The refractometer is a little device that measures the, the index at which, which the light breaks through the fluid. We will put the fluid here, close it up, look into the light, and then the refractometer will tell you in this case, how much sugar there is in the content. You've also got uh, uh, refractometers for alcohol, for sugar, for many different things, but this is one that's, uh, that's specifically for the use with honey. Well, first we got the calib calibrated. We've got some calibration honey, which is in fact just honey with a uh, uh, with a known water content, it says water content 18.4 percent, so it is uh, 20, 21.81.6 percent. Uh, Do I say that okay? Correct. Yes, that's correct. 81.6 percent sugar. It's just a honey where the, the the contents is known. The only sure way to no honey is ripe is with the refractometer. So how do we use it? Well, we'll take, we'll open it up. I'll open the honey. We'll just take a little bit of this calibration honey. Put it on there. It's glass, so be careful. We close it up. And then we look into the lights. And we can see. But I have to take another shot for that, so. Well, here you can see it through, it's through the through the lens. The light breaks, and it will show you if it will focus. Come on, I had it in focus. Yeah, there it is. It's not very visible, but on the right table it says 19.2% water, so it's a bit off. Well then, there's a little screw here near. You've got a tiny uh, screwdriver. You're gonna put it in. You're gonna turn it and check. Well, I check with my eye. Till the count, till the table shows eighteen point four or close to that. Well, this is it. Let's have a look. There it is. Now it's cal calibrated the correct way. You can test your honey, so you know your honey is, the, you know the moisture content of the honey. Honey needs to be under, uh, under 20% honey, except for heather honey. That can be a bit higher. So let's take the honey. Let's test some honey. Well, I took a bit of the freshly extracted honey. Now let's see. 
the result is let's hope it can focus will focus and it's not easy there it is you can see it's just below 18.1% it's about 17.7 17.8 which is perfect the amount of uh, sugar or the amount of water I should say in the in the honey determines how long honey is uh, what the shelf life is of honey honey above 19 to 20 percent is has a shelf life of a half year honey with uh, a moisture content content of 17 to 18 has a shelf life of two years so it makes a big difference the more water there is in the more likely it is to go bad after a while but in fact they found honey in egyptian tombs that were more than 2000 years old and it was just perfectly fine but it's a food item and a food item need a shelf life so that's why well thanks for watching hope to see you soon uh, please like and subscribe and uh, till the next time. Hi, how do?